Hi, uh, I saw your Kijiji ad about looking for somebody to work out at the gym. Was, is that your ad? Hey, uh, did you have the Kijiji ad for the VCR? Hi, this is Scott. I'm calling about your vibrator for sale. See, so you got a toilet for sale there on uh, the internet there. Oh, yes, I do, yeah. I'm looking for a few meatheads to go crush some weights at the gym. Uh, I've been trying to watch Jurassic Park for like at least three weeks. I mean, as long as it works, I can probably clean it up with something, right? But I've had like my TV stuck on like this fucked up infomercials channel for like three weeks and like I, the button's busted and I can't even shut it off. Are you in Montreal or...? Uh, I'm over in like Thunder Bay, you know where like the big elephant casino is down like on North Street? Well, I'm calling from Mississauga, but... I don't know if you ever met him, but his name's Jeremy. He sells you Adderalls behind the Sobeys at, uh, by the Clayton Park there. Do you know who I'm talking about? Uh, he I always wore, like, the Canadian's jersey, and he was just always, like, like kind of making jokes. Like, he'd run around, like, saying, like, Patrick was like, a pussy. Like, it was just, like, it was kind of like a play on words. Okay, I don't, uh, I don't really understand what you mean. You go all the way over to Clayton Park when I'm living in Dartmouth. Yeah. And then you go to Dartmouth. pretty rough, though, eh? Montreal's getting pretty rough there, eh? The other one kind of looked like a stereo that way. Eh? Doesn't really look like a very good vacuum. 3-0, would you take like $1 for all of them? You can come to the parade with me, I don't know. What? I got a bunch of Dairy Queen coupons, and I got like like 45 bucks, and that's probably like the best I could do. Like it sounded kind of like like one of those girls on Pornhub taking it, you know what I mean? Like you ever see that? It's like it almost sounded exactly the same. They're like sailors and shit, like like fucking with the toilet though. I have no idea. Okay, so if I come by tomorrow, you can show me how the vibrator works. Like you'll be able to demonstrate for me. Oh, all right. He's gone. <laughs> okay, I don't understand. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we got the excellent orange hat back. Because out of anything, this is probably the biggest thing that pisses me off the most. Like, how about it's just one big fucking Netflix and they have everything? And you know how to fix the problem? If you're, like, working there, you should be able to be rude to them and say, you know what, you stupid cunt? Like, no. Why the fuck would you ever do that, except for the cocksucker who's getting rich coming up with the idea, saying, help my fuck if it wasn't done, if it were, if they weren't fresh fries, but yeah, they weren't fresh enough, I'm sorry, they're not fucking fresh, so make them again, and I'm like, yeah, that's cool, because I don't want you in there anyway, I don't get it, even if you piss them off, like the customer off, who the fuck cares, you're not gonna go out of business, you're not, and the people who work there are just as fucking stupid, I mean, go get your grandkid, like, socks or a hat or something, like, like this hat.